Hello everybody and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3 where if I can I'm gonna go to camp and switch out Halston for Asterion because for one thing that didn't pop up as a quest in my invent or my what is it journal log you know in my quest log uh to like bring Asterion to this woman at least not that I saw so I was like excuse me okay Asterion Need Somebody has something they want to talk to you. Oh, what do you want to do about Kazdor's ritual? Before anything else, I need to know where it's happening. Uh, to the public, Kazador is an ordinary noble. A little reclusive, perhaps, but just another of the great and the good of Baldur's Gate. Oh. He has a grand palace on the hills of the gate, where he hosts the city's high society. High society. I don't know if you perform the ritual there. It feels too public. He'd risk exposure. I mean, eventually, he kind of, I, think, I think he would want that, you know, like, look at me. I mean, it seems narcissistic to the extreme, right? And they always want attention. Uh, I, ooh. Raphael's playing a dangerous game, giving you Mephistopheles secrets. I think that's good to say. Mephistopheles is one of the Lords of the Nine Hells. Raphael is not going to let any ire be tracked back to him. Perhaps Raphael even will gain from setting us on this course. Who can Yeah, that's say? a dangerous part. All I know is I need to unravel the secrets around Cazador's ritual. And I can only do that in Baldur's Gate. Danger, danger. Baldur's Gate's a dangerous place. Yes. Apparently. Uh, come, come. Well, obviously I would. I would. But you have so many... Well, in that case, I'm all yours. All right, let's go, bucko. Back out. Bye, Halsen. You can. So, Astarian, which of us would you rather feed on? What? If he had free reign. And righteous? Oh my gosh. Just a pinch of. Oh. Why is it. Ah, Asterian's voice is non existent. Hmm. Interesting. I'll bite you if you ask. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and Will's got nothing to say? I'm sure you would. Don't sound so eager. You brought it up! Shadow Arts, that playing hard to get. Okay. I am myself. Not on my mind. And, well, in it. I never thought I'd see one in real life. I read about your kind for so many years. But you are a finer specimen than any beastery could Is describe. Is that a backhanded compliment? Yeah, he's like... Is really a vampire? At least one of their spawn. Oh, don't worry. We're all friends under the absolute. I won't bite. Oh, boy. Oh, I'd prefer if you did. Yeah. And he's yours to command. No. My envy is palpable. No, the, you're misunderstanding. Yeah, excuse me, he's his own person. Yes, all night, no. He's his own person. I'm sure he really believes that. How utterly adorable. Yeah. Do you have a name, Spawn? Hey, if you're gonna... Uh, Astarian, but, but hold on. Yeah. Good. Now, Astarian... No. I've dreamt of being bitten by a vampire since I was a I young girl. I do love girl. her metallic eyeshadow. <laughs> I'm sorry. You <laughs> I'm sorry. To, <laughs> to feel your life's blood slipping what? away. To dance on the edge between life and death. This is a weird yes, embodiment of a vampire stand. I want it. I'll even compensate you. A potion of legendary power that forever increases the strength of the one who consumes it. What? It's not for sale. <laughs> But it's yours. I feel like if you bite I keep saying me, what, but I will have to decline. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Excuse me? This is a once in a lifetime opportunity and you're squandering. She's definitely a vampire student. I gave you my answer. Yeah! Oh, can't you talk some sense into your obstinate? He's his own person! He said no, there's nothing more to discuss. How very disappointing. What that was it? That was the whole interaction. Asterion was like, hold on, like, hold on a second. And like, I don't think he's, he, <laughs> he's not into biting people for their own fetishes. You know what I mean? Like, at least that's what I can, that's what I would think. Oh, 
the reaction uh, and I feel like I keep saying what, but like there's like, they talk and I don't want to necessarily interrupt, but it's like, excuse me, like what are you saying? <laughs> She's like, I want to feel my life plus any way. I'm like, girl, you are everything that is wrong with like friggin' vampire publishing industry right now. Jeez Louise. Uh, I do want to switch back. Okay, Astaire, I'm sorry I had to traumatize you. I didn't realize she was like a total stan. I was curious if she was actually a Cazador thing. And I wanted to see if like we could get any information out of her, but... Or anything that would be of help to us. But... No. She was just a weird vampire stan. Maybe it will bring us closer. You two should play. You're both like weird children now that have been like possessed by foresty shadow Hope stuff. Father preserve you. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, I need you by my side. An unwieldy number. <laughs> you must cut someone loose before An I can join unwieldy you. unwieldy number. Okay, yeah, you take a stare in this place. Ready at your side. All right, off we go. Uh, okay. Anyway, I, I feel bad. Like... I was like, hey, this lady has a proposal for you, and it turns out she just wants, like, a weird... And I'll, I can't force in. That would just get... I got two approvals, did you guys notice? I'm doing really well. Um, but no, that is just weird. It's weird. I don't like it. Let's see. Interesting. So this... There's these two different ways. Yeah. Now, do I hear? Yeah. I knew this had to be something weird. Something slimy seems to be dripping from the rafters above. Like, how could, how come I didn't perceive this earlier? Oh, I'm just trying to... Is there anything else I'm supposed to notice? seem like it. Is it up now? I think it's up. Let me move my people. Yeah. So I need to go upstairs. Acolyte, Zealot, Barnabas. Oh yeah, we talked to those ones. There's the people in here that I'm worried about talking to. In this room. We're all friends under the absolute, etc., etc. Is it this door I want to open? Nope. Absolute. Save us. You guys, oh my gosh, what is that? A warhound? Who is that? I am not going in there. Bad, bad room, bad room. That's a main. That is a main room then yeah okay I need to go find the tieflings this door oh is this oh this is the back door behind the main guy right yeah ooh Ketherick Thorm is just just right there Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We're going downstairs. I do not want to interact with him right now. I am loath to see anyone behind bars. It reminds me of my time as a guest of the goblins. That reminds me. How in the nine hells could goblins capture a chap as well muscled as you? Yeah. Poor choice of companions, for one thing. Then I shall have to Gladly rectified since then. Besides, a large enough pack of scavengers can take down even the strongest of them. It's true. Like, it's a wolf pack mentality, too. Five true souls sent for an audience, and not a single one came back down from the tower top. Must have been unworthy. Okay, are we in? Oh my gosh, hello. Um, 
I guess we can. The thing is, it's like a part of me kind of wanted to go and like talk to the people in like the main hall in front of the doors where apparently Catherine Thorne is at. I don't want to go in there. I want to go in the other room. But I really feel like we should be playing it chill, like interacting with as few people as possible to not get in trouble. But I want to know more information about this. Um, find out where the tieflings are being held in Moonrise Towers. So I got to talk to some people. And I would think they'd be down in the dungeons, like not, uh, not upstairs. Uh, be a deer and strike me deaf. I guess they're especially sobby today. Oh, okay, they are down here. Okay, 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 okay. They're probably... In the other way, but this this bodes ill. Oh, I knew there had to be a medical experimentation the area. Descended from his chapel. Oh, just kidding. It's a questioner's thing. Okay, good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Ah, uh, there's body parts. All right, let's see. These people look extremely unpleasant. Look at that walk. Plants one foot in front yeah, of the other. Yeah, she's like yeah. Head forward, back straight. Make them fear you. So she had a very robust walk. Look, look at that. She's like swinging her arms. So is she. A new face. Do as the warden says, when she says, and you'll be fine. Why are you guys like walking back and forth in here? Scroll of false life? I'm just going to take she it. She had a bag of Thank holding. You. The general has descended from his chapel. Yeah, I saw that. Scroll of speak with the dead. Well, I don't need it, but okay. Might as well. A severed leg. Love that. Scroll of hold person. I kind of want to light up one of our weapons again. That has been useful, but I don't know if I want to draw that much attention to us. Like, theoretically. Oh, are my friends down here? This is gonna be, this is gonna be rough. Maybe, please don't be dead. Please tell me I haven't wasted too much time. What do they have on them? A death war? What does that do? The next time damage would reduce the affected entity to zero hit points and remains conscious with one hit point left. What are you, orcs? Like. What did, that looks, that bodes ill. That's a very ominous looking like giant bowl for blood. There's nobody in here. This actually makes me even more nervous. I am not seeing anybody. So, oh my God. I, there they are. Cal, I remember, Cal the brother and Lee. Oh my gosh, the sister. So they're still alive at least. Oh my gosh. Dan, that's the husband. Like Rissa, I think she was the friend of the bard? Yeah. Okay, there's even more un under the ground here. Hmm, you know what? Maybe if I can get. I was just trying to think of Halson. He can burrow into the ground. I'm like, really don't know if I should like talk to them and like call attention to us because there's still guards around. Maybe I can cast like a, oh, and there's Wolverine. There's the freaking, okay. The Dwer, the Dwergar? No, those are deep gnomes. There's so many. Don't mind me just taking a tour of the cells. I'm trying to think if like any sort of disguise spell would work, but I, the limb, uh, I don't like that. Who are you? Are you someone that would speak to me? Don't speak to the prisoners. Okay. The absolute forbidden. That I'm glad I didn't just jump on in there and talk to them. I'm gonna have to like freaking distract these guys somehow. Let's see. He doesn't look like he moves, but there is a there is the wandering one. The wandering person and the um stone. I feel it. And the orb. behind the back wall and beyond. Water. I'd bet my last copper there's a pier nearby. This could be our chance, sir. 
Hmm. You guys are underground, though, I think. That's the issue. I think there's only... There's two! Hmm, okay, two orbs. One walking guard and one stationary guard. This door is open. I can just go in. Apparently. Hello? Oh, the warden. Um, hmm, okay. Um, invasion plans for the Sword Coast. A large red arrow stretches out from the east, then branches into numerous smaller arrows fanning out across the land to signify the absence. So it's just like a, a, a wish fulfillment. Book. Warden. Door. That door is locked. What's upstairs? I'll talk to you in a second. I want to get my bearings. Okay. Lots of stuff up here I'm not allowed to touch. This is all stuff I get to touch after I beat up people. This Whoa. is a restricted area. Time to explain yourself or this guard will be restricting you to a cell. Uh, misunderstanding? Try to buy your way in to what? And is that all the money I have? I belong here. Okay, why do I only get a plus one from persuasion? Oh no. I'm gonna fail on this one. Okay. I didn't this didn't say it was restricted. I am gonna fail, absolutely gonna fail. Hang on. <laughs> yes, I'm cheating. I'm cheating. So what? Uh, it didn't say it was a restricted area. I wouldn't have gone in. All, but only when I got up there and I was like, oh, look at all this red, you know, stuff I can't access. Then I was like, maybe I should go back down. I wasn't gonna poke anything even. Just about to turn around. Okay, I gotta talk to the warden and maybe try to convince her that I need to remove the prisoners. I need to get them out. Before I do any shenanigans, I need to get them out. They're not warriors. Maybe the, the deep gnomes could help, but the tieflings need to go. And if that's all that's left, like... Also, where's Zevlor? I was kind of hoping maybe the central tower would tell me where Zevlor was. Okay, so apparently they're talking like they're bored. There's nobody to, to I went back really quick. And there's nobody to, to, to torture because the absolute says they can't touch the ones in the uh, in the cells. But the, the last people were, like, they broke too quickly or whatever. I don't know. But um, it would seem that, that hopefully the people, the, the, the tieflings and stuff aren't... Have you? Fair point. Aren't being... Touched. Okay, so these they do talk a little bit. Okay. Okay, I'm going to attempt to do some jumpy jumpy stuff over here. And hope this isn't restricted. If it is, they're gonna have to jump after me. Because Halston's gotta come too. Okay, I don't want him to be left behind. Oh, I could have come from that way too. Okie dokie, Smokies. got going on this is oh my gosh this is really oh! this scared me <laughs> oh my gosh what is what is down there Ugh, I don't like that at all is that where the absolute is hang on we've got or is this what's like Slipping its way through the the halls, you know, like through the the like pink mucusy stuff. Oh, well, I, that I'm actually I feel a little ill. I did just eat, or like like not 30 minutes ago, and I actually that is making me feel a bit nauseous. Nauseous. I can't believe there's nothing around here to like tell me what it is though. Like some sort of oh yeah, this is the pit of doom. Where we feed the monster that lives in the freaking walls. See? Look at that. 
Is the absolute a monster that lives in the walls? Like, I just, uh, I hate that so much. It, right, this is all very reminding me very viscerally of Mass Effect 3, one of the endings, where you're, um, friggin', or not one of the, it is, you know, part of the ending where, like, everybody's dead in the Citadel, and, like, it's just horrific, and, oh my gosh. I hope not. I, 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 I'd make my last call. They're talking about their brother. Oh wait, I'm not supposed to be up here. Ah, get down, get down, get down, get down, get down. Is there... There's like walking, oh. I mean, I could get into the cells. I could get into the cells from the top here, it looks like, if I like finagled my way through. I'm also kind of trying to see if there's anybody actually alive in these cages, like if Zevlar, I'm looking for Zevlar. Cause he's, well, I don't know. He's like, I don't know where he is. Ryan Zevlar, he was captured, right, okay. So he's been, he's like somewhere else apparently. I didn't see him in there. Hell of. Mm hmm We almost shouldn't bring Asterion back for concerning Asterion's quest. Like it's like almost be better to like hide him away. But you know, you can't only do that for so long. So I could maybe, because these gates are closed. I wonder if I cast darkness? No. There's like no way that, yeah, this whole thing is always, somebody is always looking. Okay, I gotta, I gotta think, I gotta think, I have no idea. Heist, I have no idea. No, I should probably talk to the warden, huh? And see if I can't convince her. But there's this, too. I'm curious. Let's see if I can... This might be a chasm. There's a prisoner's journal in here. I've been watching. It looks like this corner and this book, specifically, are not watched. I'm going to try to read this prisoner journal. Well, there is... I'm cheating and looking through the wall. There is a hallway back there. Can I... Okay, through there. All right, let's give that a look, I guess. Oh yeah, and up here, they were right. I should not doubt rock gnomes. Oh, you can cast Mei Chan as a bonus hand, but it only gives her telekinesis. Throw a creature or object with your mind. Once per turn, you can use telekinesis again while concentrating. Would telekinesis work on an object? Throw it up here. Better get to work. Oh, where did it go? Did it? Oh, it broke! It broke! No, okay, never mind. I'm doing that. I would Misty Step down, but I want to use Misty Step to get her back up. I think somebody has some Feather Fall boots. No, no, it's in I'm gonna try to heat her in there. Yeah. Another parasite. Collect it. So it might luck. be useful. Almost dizzy with the smell of it. It didn't say chasm. It said I could jump in there. Oh, the oblate. I don't know how to say that, but you, oh my gosh. What? Yeah. What? You're like yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sure. I'll steal the parasite. Why is it acting like I have pop-ups? Oh my gosh, I knew there was something bad in here. I might actually reload just to have us all come down here. I do not want her exploring this by herself. Oh, this is so gross. Yeah, this is, I think, a team activity. 
Cannot fast travel from this area? Oh no! I would have to reload. I knew there was something here. Okay, I did, I did actually, um, quick save right before jumping in so and i picked up the book because i was afraid i wouldn't have time to read it so maybe i'll try to read it really quick because maybe that book was like hey if you jump in there you're gonna jump into like the most worst thing ever but it's interesting is there was a true soul down there that had been like thrown in or something maybe the journal will tell us but um and the mind worm hadn't been re you know taken you know they like they like to reuse those i think read you hear things down here, and things from people with nothing left to lose, no more secrets to keep. You hear that Kethler's in touch books, that he isn't really, that he got some relic or other in the mausoleum, a link, that's what you hear. And you hear that link can be severed. You hear things like that, but you mostly hear them from people who are already out of their minds. See, and this is why I was like, oh man, I'll go get the secret first. And, and then I'll freaking like come up here and my friend a couple of my friends that said that the secret isn't actually that important which i don't know at this like we're already we're in it to win it at this point like i knew that the secret existed uh and maybe i could have grabbed it that's i don't know it seems like the secret's towards the end of of the gauntlet of char uh and it seemed like the way my friend was saying that i can't get the secret without finishing the gauntlet of char but like, what's the point of a kether form secret once i defeat him Unless she was saying that if I need, like, I need to come in here and I need to, I don't have to interact with Kethrick Thorne first, but I, if I wanted to rescue all these people that needed to be rescued, I need to do that before doing the secret. So maybe I do that and just really, like, metagame it. Well, pain. You guys can see me, but I'm, like, doing, like, weird things with my hands. I'm, like, where? Like, weaving them in and out. Okay, well, um, horrifying, horrifying, that was horrifying. We are definitely bringing people with us, uh, before engaging in those sorts of shenanigans. Ooh, can I? Yes, okay, thank you. No time to waste. No time to waste. Thing is, is we could get in there. But I have, we'd have to get out another way, especially since you can't fast travel when you're down there. AKA, I'm going to go talk to the Water. warden. I'd bet my last copper there's a pier nearby. And I need to go check out that pier behind. Because there might be a way to, ugh, there might be a way to break them out. Even if I need to kill every bastard in this house. Through the. I know. And I'll be right alongside you if it comes to uh, we I can break we out can people Not through now. the back wall, maybe. Never. Um. Never. Warden first. Step. Warden first. All right. Let's see if I can't talk my way in and out of some shenanigans. Hmm. You spark of the familiar. Do I know you, true soul? I sure hope not. Hmm. Perhaps not. Your face is rather bland. Whatever your what? business, a I worked really hard on it. None may speak to the prisoners. Disciple Balthazar was most clear. Balthazar, I remember that name. Ooh, <laughs> okay, let's try. Give me bonuses. Ooh, okay. Your mind swirls with information about the prison. The small levers behind the warden's desk open every cell, while the larger one triggers the alarm. And interesting items confiscated from prisoners uh -huh. lie above the warden's office, just up the ladder. Awkwardly standing here. If you are going to stare, kindly do it elsewhere. As I said, you are free to roam where you wish, but do not speak to the prisoners. Let's have a chit chat, chit chat. But yeah, obvious. No, she's she's an absolute. That's a dumb question. Um, why ban speaking to prisoners? Or should I try to true soul it up? Disciple Balthazar has plans for them, and were I you, I would not get in the way. She who does she? She talks like Minthara. I was like trying to see like the way that her 
body was moving. She talks like how Minthara talks. Uh, this could maybe out me. Um, I'm looking for a particular prisoner, dude Ravenguard. He sounds important, and I'm afraid the mere dregs are the only ones left in my care. Was he in that room <gasps> with Catherick Thorne and I just didn't see him? Uh, these are dumb. The rules don't apply. This was the only one that could maybe be okay. Um, leavers behind her desk. The alarm might be the best, like, then it would maybe, like, I don't know if it would bring everybody here, or send them out, you know? I wonder if we could charm her. Okay, I am considering the charm be. spell. It will make it so that an enemy, or that somebody does not attack you. And if we close the door and use charm, we could potentially release the levers on these doors, but then we'd have these guards to deal with. Ugh, I didn't know what it was here. So yeah, this is why I'm thinking, I think we gotta pull the emergency alarm first. I think that's gonna be our best bet. <coughs> Mm -mm. And charm only lasts 10 turns. Come on, everybody. And the she... The I, 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 it says on higher difficulties... Oh my gosh, really? He's too tiny. He's too small. Sylvanas' blessings. Sylvanas' blessings. Path is interrupted. Can you... You're all... You are all incapable? Re like, really? There is work I know I am strong. No time so let's like try present. that. Ah, uh, look, Shadowheart, smart. Why what didn't you next? all try that? On my way. What? Is the path still too high? There is no way my that faith will guide she me. is stronger than he is. I am ready. She? Well, I could have him transform, actually. I don't know if that would instigate anything, but. It might actually be better to have him transformed as an animal companion I'm while running we're running it. around anyway, actually, now that I think about it. Oh my gosh, Will is also too weak. Weak, and we don't have... Oh, he could Misty Step. Alright, we'll have him Misty Step up here. And I will have I'm prepared. Housen. Nah. What do you want to be? A dire raven? And just hope that this doesn't set anybody off on us. Alright. Let's go, friends. Let's move. It's too bad it's not easier to climb. I was kind of worried they'd get mad at us because it seems like they're not supposed to access it. Mm. Nasty, spooky, yucky stuff. Whoa! It scared me. I'll say there's nasty, yucky, spooky stuff, and then freaking they're like survival check. I'm like, <gasps> indigo die. Don't mind if I do. Oh, do you have anything to say? I expect corpses near dead ends to give me- Oh! Oh, is this how we get into that nasty little place? It probably is. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm being very smug. Not that- I don't know. I don't know why I stay. <laughs> so there is a way out. That's good to know. I guarantee you this wall 
can be broken. This wall can be broken. We can get these people out. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm going to put a marker here. There's an actual path here. Well, there, there you go. Of course, it's the freaking deep gnomes and not... What's the warden doing out and about? Every single time the prisoner cries out for the absolute right before they die. You will be no different, little Wolverine. It's only a matter of time till we're served up to the necromancer on a platter. We'll get you to Boulder's Gate, sir. I swear it. Damn straight. He seems like a Without jerk. Me, everything will be for naught. Okay, so we can at least get the deep gnomes out. Uh, it will set off an alarm. I don't know if I should, like... Oh, hello? Hmm. What's that? I don't know if I should, like, break it first. I probably... Well, if I should set off the alarm first? Ugh. Uh, scroll of sea invisibility. Who wants that? We can get that, dude. Well. Yay. And I picked up the secret stash. I'm, like, constantly hitting alt, trying to see what else there is. Oh, is this the tiefling's wall? Oh my gosh. If I... Mm. The thing is, it actually is nice to know anyway, because I'm like, well, th this is, like, two different approaches. It's... it's n it kind of is. I was like, it's, it's either break the walls and sneak them out the back, or set off the alarm and use the levers to open up the gates, you know? Um... Get us out of here, Cal. To kill Ed. No, listen, we ain't killing nobody. You guys are going back home. Let me make sure that there's nobody here that will jump us. Curse to put my hands on everything. It cannot be used. Oh! <gasps> so if I tried to break them out without checking on it, and I hadn't broken the ropes, we would be, like, trapped here? Oh, my gosh. Okay, time to break the ropes, just in case. Let's see. Okay. I was like, I stood up so abruptly, I thought I had triggered a cutscene or something. I was like, oh, no. current is powerful, pulling at the boat. Should you leave, you will not be able to return to Moonrise Towers this way. Is the boat gone? Okay, I was like, okay, I was hoping, my worry was that if I let the ropes go, it would swoosh away. But what I'm hoping is that I can get the people out and you won't be able to get back into Moonrise this way. That would be fine. Now I'm kind of wondering if I should go into the abattoir thing. Uh, I don't know how you say it. The, I think it's an abattoir. It's a place, wait, it, it looks like oubliette, but I think it's abattoir. Oubliette. A secret dungeon with access only through a trapdoor in it. See, that's the definition of an oubliette. Oh. I thought that was where, like, what's what's an abattoir? That's like a meat grinder, right? Abattoir. I have no idea how to spell it. Yes, abattoir. Abattoir. Yes. Abattoir. Abattoir. <laughs> uh, it's a slaughterhouse. So that's what I thought. The oubliette was abattoir. Uh, no, oubliette is a dungeon that has only one entrance from a trapdoor up above. But this oubliette is basically an abattoir, so there. <laughs> uh, okay, 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 okay. I need to decide. <laughs> I need to make decisions. I might save and go down there to see what's up with that nasty thing. Because at the very least, it seems like I can get back out again. Or it could be something else entirely down there. I don't know. But it seems close enough to this that it's like, ugh, like I should figure out what's going on in the bowels, but I should free the teaklings for, I mean, I'm going to contemplate. Okay, what I'm kind of hoping I can do is free everyone, 
because I'm worried if I go down into the belly of the beast, whatever is down there, will trigger stuff. You know, it will trigger Kethric, maybe. You know, trigger the whole fortress. And I don't want to trigger that while the Tieflings and the Deep Gnomes are still here. So, I need to get them out through this way, as long as I don't have to take this with them. That's the issue here, is that it's like, oh, you can go. And I'm like, I just want to send people on it. I don't want to go with them. I want, then I, I want to set them free and then go down here if I can. But doing one or the other may set off something that makes it so I can't do the other one. Or I could just go down here and see what's going the frick on and it would be fine. Like, you know, and then I could come back up and deal with this. But I don't want to keep save scumming necessarily because <laughs> I will do it a lot. Um, so, I think I'm going to try to free these guys. I just need to decide now how I want to do that. Charm the warden. No, yeah. Hmm. I will figure it out. I will figure it out, and by the next episode, I will have something figured out. So thank you all for joining me. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, including my Acorn Tier patrons. Thank you so much, Bane, for your support. I very much appreciate it, and I want to give an extra special shout-out to Reese Kalita, my Sapling Tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my forest tier patron, who's gone above and beyond and has supported me in the channel and who I cannot thank enough. So thank you all again, and I hope to see you in the next one.